Hey, what's up guys? My name is Praetorian and welcome back to Total Warhammer 2 as we are playing with the Dark Elves. So we left off here. We decided not to hit the end turn button. I uh, had a shorter episode uh, because I, I have a good feeling that they're going to attack us um, at the, when, once we do hit that end turn because um, they outnumber us by quite a bit. I don't believe there's anything we need to do here, so let's go ahead and end our turn. Uh, so I'm recording this on, on Thursday. Um, it's Friday's video. Uh, and last night, you know, because I had today off, um, I decided to drink. And uh, while drinking, I made the decision to uh, uh, try a new campaign out. I'm playing as the Lizardmen, um, as Crocar, and man, I am having an absolute blast. The Lizardmen are a lot of fun, guys. Uh, definitely recommend them as a faction. So um, they did attack us, as we expected. Uh, so we have three armies here uh, with three warlords. Uh, it looks like it's all clan rats and uh, Skaven Slayers with a couple of those Night Runners in here. Those Night Runners are really not all that bad. They're pretty good overall. Um, yeah, they do a good job. Uh, and they're going to outnumber us by quite a bit. I don't even know what the numbers are. However, the balance power is in our favor. How We're going to fight this out just because there's so many rats here. I, don't, I just don't trust the AI to, uh, to do it. I think we can reduce the amount of casualties if we fight it manually. All right, guys, we are into the battle. We're going to go ahead and lead the Winds of Magic as it is. Uh, and just to manage this a little bit more, because it might end up getting a bit crazy, there are a lot of uh, units per fight, and I saw that in the loading screen. Uh, it is, right now, we only see 1755. Um, and that's just with the one army on here. Remember, there's two more armies uh, coming in here. So, I don't know, it's probably going to be like 4,000 or something. I think I said that before, and that sounds like a good, uh, good number. Um, so, yeah, that's what I'm thinking. We're going to go ahead and create some groups here. Uh, because, yeah, I, I think it would help us manage this a little a little bit easier. Uh, make sure that uh, it doesn't get too crazy over here. Uh, so let's go ahead and put all these guys in there. There we go. Excellent. So, yeah, that looks pretty good. Got our melee, our uh, archers, and our, our cavalry all in one number. I meant to make these three, but you know what? Four will work, too. We could just change it. Won't be no problem at all. All right, excellent. So one, two, three. Um, let's go ahead and move all these. I'll move them over here. Uh, and then we're going to put our archers up here in the front. Uh, we know what we're going to do. We're going to move as far over to this direction as we can. Um, I think that would be uh, a wise decision here uh, because um, these guys are coming from this side. So we'll let us wrap these ones up first. Um, and I think that would be the best bet for us right now. I don't really care what order these guys are in uh, right now. Uh, and then we're going to go ahead and put two of the cavalry on this side over here. Um, yeah, it looks pretty good. Do these guys have out? Can they, uh, huh? Can they deploy out here? They can deploy out here. All right, interesting. I was not aware of that. All right, we'll put them right there. Uh, or we can put them over here. That's fine, too. Oops, they don't fit. Put them right there. Okay, excellent. Uh, and then we're gonna put two over on this side as well. All right, and let's go ahead and get our leader in the middle and give them a little bit of artillery support. And we are ready to start the battle, though I did not notice this. Standard round. Or a multi-shot round. Huh, interesting. So it allows you to shoot faster. While this one here gives you a bonus against large. All right, well, we're probably going to do the multi-shot round, right? That makes sense. It's rats. There's a whole huge number of rats here. Let's go ahead and we're going to do that. Um, and then we're going to have them fire fire at them there. We are going to move forward. Uh, we're going to move all of our troops forward here with the exception of we don't need them moving forward. Uh, and, yeah, let's go ahead and get them going. Um, just a little bit closer to the rats here. Try and get them uh, firing a little bit quicker. All right, yeah, look at that. They're firing a ton of rounds at them. All right, that's awesome to see. Uh, we're going to go ahead and get these uh, cavalry over here on the side. Hopefully we can get these guys wrapped up before the uh, their, su their support comes. Yeah, we're already looking at 3,600 uh, troops here, and I expect there to be more. I was expecting about 4,000. That sounds about right. Um, so they are sending some clan rat spears after us. Fire! So we're going to try and fire as much as we, we can uh, before they get here. Let's go ahead and move these guys. Uh, we're going to move them up over here. Run, cavalry! All right, and then we're going to bring these cavalry. Uh, we're going to bring them up over here. Actually, you know what? These guys are going to run down the... I don't know how well this is going to work out. They're going to run down those night runners. All right, they have charged us. Um, so let's let's send in our troops here. Let's get them charging. Uh, charge men. All right. Um, and yes, I do have to say it like that every single time. Uh, let's get them going forward here. Uh, we're going to have these guys charge into them. And we definitely outnumber them here. Um, like quite a bit. Oh, wait a minute. You guys got to go out to them. Go, man. Go. All right. Uh, and then we're going to bring these guys up behind here. Uh, you can see that they're already running some of these clam rat spears. Uh, they decided not to come after us here. So let's go ahead and bring our, our, our cavalry uh, behind here. 
Um, these guys will continue chasing after those night runners. The night runners are super deadly um, because they, you know, we're going to have to bring some some troops over here to guard against these guys probably. That's what I'm thinking. Um, let's bring these two here. Oh, these are our best ones. All right, we don't really want them not fighting. Uh, let's get them into the battle over here. Uh, we'll bring these ones here. Uh, you will guard. <laughs> All these guys have to guard by themselves. They can handle it. I believe in them. All right, we're going to send in, actually, let's go ahead and send in all of our ranged troops uh, start pelting these guys. Or, you know what? They're probably going to get killed doing that. Let's instead do it this way. Alright. Alright, excellent. And I forgot about our, our general. He does have some new abilities here. Let's go ahead and make use of them. Uh, we have a vortex now. Uh, let's put that into right there. And then we're going to get him thrown into this battle as well. Nice. That is looking lovely. Go ahead and start charging here, and we're going to make sure we use our Winds of Magic, which somebody taught me a little trick here. Uh, we can change the direction of the winds. That's pretty cool. Yeah, that is awesome. Hit them. Charge. All right, and let's get these cavalry going over here. You're going to charge right there. You guys are going to hit them right there. All right, excellent. So they did run. They attempted to anywhere. Where's our other cavalry units here? Are they still engaging? Yes, they are. They're currently still engaging those night runners and having some difficulty, it would seem. All right, um, let's see, what are you guys currently doing? Why did you guys not go over here like I told you to? Come over here and cover these, uh, this front here. All right, so we've got them all on the run, uh, with the exception of the one warlord here. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to send him in to deal with the warlord and then get the rest of these troops over here um, to cover this front. All right, excellent. Um, while these guys kind of just chase down troops over here, uh, we'll probably use a cavalry a lot for that. Come on, get him. Charge, man. All right, and we do have the Night Runners over here, so we do have to worry about that. Uh, them coming over here and getting our guys. Uh, are you guys still chasing down? They are still chasing down those Night Runners right now. But I think they're good to go. They can come assist here uh, momentarily. Uh, and we do have rats just about everywhere right now. Um, let's charge. All right, let's go ahead and get all these guys. You guys are going that way. You guys are going this way. All right, excellent. And then we're going to go ahead and bring these guys, uh, all of our Archer guys, that are over on this side of things. We're going to let them pelt from this side. All right, you guys are going over that way. Um, and then you guys are also going to come over here. Uh, and you guys will go like so. All right, excellent. Um, so we're going to go ahead and use these bolt runner guys, our bolt uh, shooters. Fire at the clan rats with shields. Uh, we have some more troops over here that are currently not fighting. Let's go ahead and get them going over here. Uh, they're going to be coming over this way. Right there, please. Uh, we just got to reassemble ourselves here. Um, we're going to bring... Actually, you know what? These guys will fight them. And these guys here will come this way instead. Just change that up a little bit. Uh, we're going to bring the cavalry. Um, we're going to bring them over this way. And I think that's just about it. Yeah, we got our leader over here. Uh, currently, he was supposed to be fighting this warlord here. Let's get him over there uh, doing that. Get over there. Fight. Uh, we could use the vortex, though, before he goes. Um, put it right, right there. Yeah, we'll use that Vortex once before he goes. I don't know if we're going to hit anybody. It looks like we're not going to. I uh, got a couple guys, um, but yeah, not too not too bad. I wish I'd gotten a few more. That would have been a little bit more optimal here. Uh, what are you guys doing? The Cavalry are done fighting over here. Let's go ahead and get them going uh, to the rear here. Right there. All right, excellent. Uh, what is this Cavalry current doing? They are currently fighting. We don't really want them in this mess here. Let's get them out of there. Let's pull them back. Um, is that the best direction to go? Yes, it probably is. Let's go ahead and move them out. Uh, these guys are, are just running and messing the entire line up. As you can see, the line's getting pretty sloppy here. That's kind of the way it is fighting the... Uh, whenever I fight these guys, these rats here, I see that happening. Um, just because it's so difficult... You know, you guys fire into them. Um, just because it's so difficult uh, with the rats constantly retreating and coming back again, it causes a lot of trouble um, for your troops to be able to kind of stay in a, a good line. Um, so you guys are going to go this way. Get over there. Um, I don't know. What is this? Dark Conduit. Causes matter to go down. Large explosion area. Strong versus single unit. Um, but it has these negatives for the... Because you target on an ally, it seems. Okay. It's interesting. All right. Well, I'm not going to do it yet. If you guys know exactly what this does here. Because it, it seems that yeah, you target an ally and then you get uh, negative vigor and ability recharge rate. Huh. That's interesting. Yeah, I'm not sure how that works. I don't know why I'm way over here, guys. Because I am, that's why. Are we still fighting this guy? We are. All right, we'll keep him over there. Let's bring this cavalry unit here. Let's get him going to the back over here. 
All right, let's unpause that. All right, excellent. So uh, things are looking good. Um, they did have 4,000. That's 4,100. Um, a lot of men dying right now. We're trying to get our murderous prowess. We need a few more uh, deaths before we have it. Uh, let's go ahead and get these cavalry run into the back here. Um, I want them going this way. We're going to charge up behind those troops there. Uh, and this guy here is also going to come this way as well. You know what? We should hit those. Uh, I know what we're going to do. We're going to hit these guys. And then you guys are going to come that way. All right, excellent. And then these other troops that are back here, uh, we'll make use of them. God, I hate how they can fire uh, while running. We're going to have them hit them in the back there. Um, because, yeah, they are doing a lot of damage to us. What are the, How are these guys doing? They are not doing well. They have taken a ton of casualties. Get into that battle, please. Did we destroy him yet? Yes, we did. Let's go ahead and get... We're not going to chase him down. I'm really tempted to. Hmm... Yeah, I'm tempted to chase this guy down so he can't come. You know what? We will chase him down. We're going to bring our general into the battle, though. Uh, get him going over here. Uh, definitely need some assistance there. Go ahead and use that vortex as well as soon as he can. Uh, and then, yes, we are in a mess over here with all these Skaven uh, uh, slingers here. Uh, quite a few of them. And, yeah. <laughs> Those uh, cavalry are going to take significant damage back there. I'm going to tell you that right now. They're going to take a whole lot of damage. Uh, let's go ahead and get these guys going over there. You guys are going to come over here and kill that guy. Uh, and then you guys are going to kill him. All right, we're going to get this guy charging into these spears here right from the, the flank. Uh, and then you should be attacking. Um, told you to attack. He said, no, I don't I don't feel like it. Uh, where do we want to launch our wind ability here? Uh, because it seems that, yeah, this is kind of a mess. There's not really any good collection of them uh, where it would be useful for us to hit them. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not seeing anybody. Let's uh, do it right there. I should hit some of them, right? Psh, barely any. Wasn't worth it. All right, get in there. Get in the battle, men. All right, so yeah, we're just pelting them from all around here. Uh, we're going to get these guys going into there, attacking them. Uh, you guys are going to come over here and attack them. And the cavalry, I completely forgot about these cavalry here. Let's chase down some units so that they can't come back. Um, and then, yeah, let's go ahead and get all these guys uh, pelting. And you guys are going this way. All right, excellent. Anybody not currently working here? Um, we got some uh, guys there that are, you know, not fighting. Um, you guys are going to come over here and fight that warlord, or the engineer, I should say. Uh, and then where is our general here? He should be in the battle, getting uh, rough with them. Yeah, everybody's running. Uh, that is a victory, guys. We did take a ton of fucking casualties. Um, it was pretty bad overall. Um, we almost lost our uh, bleak swords here. They might actually, I don't know if they'll be considered lost or not. Uh, let's go ahead and use our ability. Uh, we're going to use use it like, where can we hit somebody? Got our guys like really far away right now. All right, hit them like so. I don't know if that's going to hit anybody. Eh, we got a couple of them, I guess. I think we hit mostly our own forces here. Uh, we are going to be chasing down units. Um, any cavalry here that's currently not uh, chasing units. And we lost a lot of our cavalry. Had a lot of issues there with those guys. And get them chasing down somebody. Um, and you are going to chase down somebody as well. All right, um, let's just go ahead and fast forward this. Uh, and then we'll we'll chase down as many as we can, get as many rats killed as possible. Um, and where are you at? You are way over here. Why don't you chase down those clan rats there? Uh, and you can shoot you can shoot the clan rats. Sure, why not? Um, instead of moving there all crazy. Uh, and then these cavalry here are not chasing anybody. Go, go get somebody. Um, a lot of our cavalry retreated. This fucking sucks. All right. Um, I don't think anybody else is going to chase them or he's going to catch them. Uh, let's go ahead and tell the these guys to stop. Um, yeah, we don't want them attacking any further. Except in the fact that those cavalry are about to get them. All right. So already caught these guys. That's awesome to see. Um, let's have these guys attack them and then see if we can catch. No, we're not going to catch those clan rats. That's not happening. All right. Charge. I think that's it. Yep, that is it, guys. Um, so, yeah, everybody, there we go, in the battle. We got Field Marshal. I'm not entirely sure what that uh, achievement was for. I'm interested to see the casualties. We lost 726. That is a lot, guys. That's a ton of casualties. Um, but look how many they lost. They lost uh, a bit more. Um, not as many as I'd hope. A lot of them ran. They just run. That's where they, it's so. That's why it's so difficult fighting these guys, because uh, they won't stay on the goddamn battlefield. Um, but in total, it looks like uh, maybe killed... Uh, on 1700 
something like that. Um, so yeah, not bad. Uh, just as far as it seems our, our guy killed the most, 248. Uh, everybody else performed uh, suitably, I guess. Um, but yeah, we'll see you after this loading screen. All right, close victory here. Um, got ourselves a ton of loot, so that's excellent. Not that money's really been an issue for us in this campaign. We did level up, so that's good to see. Uh, completely wiped out a few units here. Looks like we lost uh, one of our bleak swords as well, so that's unfortunate. Um, we'll have to merge some of these too, probably, because uh, if we decide to stay here anyway. Um, so what we're going to do is we are going to... Um, enslave them, get those slaves, that's a ton of slaves, and I remember that's that bonus that we're getting. Um, but most importantly, to uh, increase the health of our, our guys, uh, because, yeah, we took quite a few casualties, 700 dudes, uh, that we lost there. Let's see if they attack again. Um, we've seen them attack twice, it looks like they decided not to. Uh, they took far too many casualties here. I think they, they brought their troops up to reinforce in case we do end up attacking uh, the settlement. So it looks like uh, quest successful, 500 battle captives, okay. Uh, we got 10 scrolls of Akardi, uh and 1,500 in the treasury from that. Uh, got a new uh, quest. North answers the hags trying the Witch King's patience, for the northern borders of Nagaroth are vast. He demands a more specific location with a threat that Grond will burn if a satisfactory answer is not given. The death hags looks unmoved. They know that Grond is Marath city, or Marathi city, and that her son would not risk her wrath. Perhaps they do not know the Witch King. Um, what? They want me to attack my mommy? Okay, whatever. Um, so, <laughs> sign on aggression pact with the Hag Grafe. Um, I suppose we could probably assign a uh, non aggression pact with them for a little bit of money. Let's just take a look at our diplomacy here, here and see what we might want to do. Um, do we want to trade with these guys? Will Speak they trade with us? Let's take a look. They will not. Okay, well, fuck you too. Uh, we're not trading with them. Those are our future enemies. Uh, the Forge Bound can't really do anything with them. We're already trading with these guys. Let's take a look at them. They will do an non-aggression pact. They actually badly want an non-aggression pact. Um, so let's make them pay for it. Um, if this it won't be free. Uh, let's see if they'll they'll pay for that. Maybe. Let's do a uh, let's do a thousand here. All right, excellent. Let's see if they'll. Uh, no, they don't want that. All right, let's tick that down to maybe eight hundred. Nope, still won't do that one either. Six hundred. Let's try that. Definitely not. Uh, they just straight up rejected that shit. God damn. All right. Uh, let's try again. Uh, maybe a little bit less. How about 300? Will you do that? As They've accepted that. All right, excellent. So uh, we got ourselves a non-aggression pact with them. Um, also, um, we got ourselves a little bit of money as well. Uh, let's see if there's anybody else who wants to make any deals. These guys don't particularly like us here. Um, let's just see, probably because we're dealing with, I'm guessing that's their enemies. Can't trade with them. Uh, can we trade with these guys? It looks like we might be able to. Let's just take a look here. They're not interested in it, though. Okay, well, fuck you two. All right, so we did finish that mission. They got us 500 in our treasury and four scrolls. Uh, we have a total of 101 scrolls. We need 350 before we can do that first uh, ritual. Uh, so it's going to be a while. It will be a while. We can level our character up, so let's go ahead and do that. Um, Ma uh, Malekith. We need to get a new uh, hero. I don't know if we have any heroes available. I'm going to take a look at that. I would like to have a hero. I don't think we do, though, guys. I really don't. Uh, so what we want to do, I think we need to improve our combat ability a little bit. Uh, what do we have here? So, oh, okay. Sadistic. That seems useful. Weapon strengths when fighting hell high elves for eternal hatred. Um, all right, I think that gives weapon strength no matter what, uh, but most beneficial when you're fighting the high elves. So we're not going to do that. I think we might do this one because that seems like some really good bonuses there. Yeah, let's do that. Sadistic. All right, excellent. So it should give our guy a little bit of a bonus when he's fighting armored units. Not that we've been fighting any armored units lately. Do we want to go ahead and attack here? Hmm. I think we might. Let's, uh, let's see how, what our odds are here of, uh, winning. And do we want to merge any of these units? Could be beneficial uh, because we're not even replenishing right now. So let's let's go ahead and merge these. We're gonna move to merge these two here. All right, and I think that's it. I think that's good. Um, and let's go ahead and see how uh, what our odds are of winning here. Not great, not great at all. Okay, that's unfortunate. Uh, just too many goddamn rats, I guess. Uh, I imagine they're gonna attack us again here uh, when the turn ends. Hmm. All right, that's that's unfortunate. Uh, let's continue the siege. Um, if they attack me, uh, we'll defend ourselves. Um, but yeah, it looks like they are taking uh, attrition as well, so that kind of helps us out, their army there. Where is the other army? 
Is it these guys? Okay, they're inside the town right now. They're not able to replenish. Um, and these guys can't replenish either. They're actually taking casualties. Okay. Um, and then, of course, we have the garrison as well. So I just wanted to make sure that we weren't going to end up facing more casualties or having to face more rats um, that they were replenishing as we were not able to. Uh, so I think we decided there wasn't anything we were able to get here until we leveled this up to three. Um, and that'll be our next objective uh, once we get the population. Uh, we're not going to spend it on uh, this this town. Instead, we'll spend it on, on our capital. Uh, we do have some openings here. This will allow us to get better Dark Riders plus Repeater Crossbow Dark Riders. This will bring us more income. Uh, or we could build something entirely new, um, which I think the Denna Outlaws is what we're thinking about getting so that we can get the uh, Shades. Yeah, that's probably what we'll end up getting. Uh, Black Roads. Okay, some good bonuses here. Um, let's, let's go ahead and... I think what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and get the... Uh, messenger's Lodge House, so we can get better Dark Riders. Um, our Dark Riders could definitely use some shields. They they haven't done too well, um, and we have the money. We could actually keep on building stuff. Let's go ahead and build this, uh, and then I suppose we can build something here as well. We already know what we're going to get. Uh, we know that we're going to get the uh, Den of Outlaws, um, so that does suck because that's our last open uh, location here, but that's all right. We'll get the Den of Outlaws. That'll give us shades, um, so we can actually build those anyway, uh, and I think... We're gonna go here. Oh, one thing I want to do before we end the turn is I want to check if we can recruit any heroes. No, no, no heroes. Well, that's that's unfortunate. Doesn't seem any of these places has openings. I did want to check it though, just to be sure. No, there's no openings here. All right, so yeah, we cannot cannot recruit any heroes. Um, we could really use one too, uh, but whatever. It is what it is. Um, I think. We should probably merge these cavalry units as well. They took a considerable number of casualties too. Uh, so we're gonna merge these. Um, merge. All right, excellent. Um, and I think we're good to go, guys. We're gonna go ahead and end our turn. I expect they're gonna attack us again. Um, and we won't have that yet. Uh, that's more income and we will get uh, more casualties captured from post battle. Uh, before we end the turn though, let me just take a look at how the slaves are affecting things. Uh, public order is currently reducing right now because of the slaves. Um, all right, we're getting a little bit of income from them, so that's good. Uh, is there anything we can do about the slaves right now? Or the public order, for that matter? Yeah, we're kind of working on it uh, here as it is, trying to reduce the public order. We've had massive problems with order uh, in this campaign. Let's go ahead and end our turn. I expect that they're going to attack us again, guys. Um, so this might end up being a little bit longer episode because uh, we're going we're gonna to go ahead and fight that battle out. Uh, but yeah, uh, I hope it's a little bit easier uh, where we don't take as many casualties. Yeah, we lost 700 or something guys last time. That's quite a bit for us. Um, you know, even if we are killing like 1,800 of their troops. Uh, and then it seems that the beastmen are on the move. These guys have been having a lot of issues over here. Um, Cloven Blood Gorge, I think that was the guy we just saw move. Uh, so we did get the technology continuous slave supply, so that's awesome. We are just bringing in a ton of income. That's what I like to see. We do have a research available now. Uh, so let's go ahead and get something. We're going to get, hmm, I almost want to go for the experience there. Uh, oh, we already have the experience. Um, the leadership. Yeah, we could go with the leadership. We could also go with the speed. That would help us chase down units. Um, or we can go with, you know what, let's go with the public order. Having enough problems with public as order as it is, so might as well go for it. Um, so, uh, they didn't attack us, interestingly enough. They are no longer, um, suffering attrition, though, so that's bad. Uh, what would happen if we attacked right now? Let's just take a look at our odds of winning here. Uh, they are not high, um, but at the same time, I don't want them replenishing all their troops here. So, do we have enough? We have two siege towers and one battering ram. Is that enough to engage them? I don't know. Uh, probably not. Um, it just doesn't seem like it's going to be enough. Um, but I feel like we're going to have to do it. God damn it. I wish we had another battering ram at the very least. Two more turns. They could recruit a ton of units in two more turns. Uh, and this battle is already going to be tough enough as it is. So I kind of feel like we have to attack right at this moment. So let's let's do it, guys. Let's attack it. Uh, we're going to fight it out. We're, we're going to have to use a lot of ladders. Um, <laughs> that's just the way it is, guys. So welcome to the battle for the Altar of Ultimate Darkness. Uh, let's just take a look at their base here. Um, they have a gatehouse right there. Um, and then there's another gatehouse over here. There's not one in the center. All right, that's interesting. Um, hmm. I think what we're going to do... We don't have... I want to make sure the reinforcements aren't coming from behind us. They are not. Um, what we're going to do here 
is we will attack. They're all of our units are already over in this direction, so we'll attack from this direction. It is absolutely fine. Uh, I did want these guys on the um, the tower. Uh, we're gonna have them go probably up the middle here, right there. They're gonna take. Nope, that's the. Oh, they're not on the tower. All right, we don't want that. Uh, let's go ahead and take them off. Uh, we want them on a tower. I don't want them taking unnecessary casualties. Uh, let's just have um, them drop their siege equipment. That is fine. Uh, they will grab that up, and then you guys will grab this up. All right, excellent. Let's just go ahead and pull you guys back for a second. Uh, I want them to attack right there. And just, no, no, right there. Yeah, we're going to have them attack that tower right there, uh, and then we'll have the other ones attack uh, over here, I suppose. We could do ladders over there, actually. Yeah, we'll attack um, right there, I think, uh, with this other tower here. Uh, you guys will go right here. All right, excellent. Uh, and then let's go and grab these guys up. You guys are gonna be attacking. Let's see, uh, oh, we want to we want to start deployment. We don't want to gamble. Go and attack. Have these guys come straight up. And attack the uh, the gatehouse. Um, and then the cavalry here. We're gonna put them in the back. Uh, no reason to have them up in the front here. They're just gonna take unnecessary casualties uh, because yeah, they can't do anything until we get to the gatehouse. Uh, and then uh, I think that's good to go. Uh, we just need to put some troops over here to get the to put their ladders up. Uh, we'll put uh, we're gonna put maybe one of these guys. I don't care which one. Any of these guys, they're gonna try and take. Uh, they're gonna try and use their ladders up here at the top. Um, and then we're also gonna send this guy here. Uh, we're gonna grab one of the stronger troops um, to also deploy a ladder right there. Uh, those guys are deploying a ladder there. We got those guys deploying there. We're going to try and get a ladder on this side as well uh, with uh, these guys right here. All right, excellent. Um, and then the rest of them can kind of stay where they're at. I don't really care. Doesn't really matter. Um, I don't know how beneficial this guy's going to be. Uh, these guys, though, they can try and fuck up the gatehouse, right? Can they shoot the gatehouse? I don't know. Maybe they can, maybe they can't. Um, can damage buildings. All right, so both they says that they can. So we'll see. Uh, let's go and start the battle. Um, yes, let's go ahead and have them shoot at the gatehouse so that they can uh, kind of weaken it before our uh, bleak swords here get there. Attack there. All right, and then these guys, where, which one are they? They're right there. So we want them to put the tower right there. Uh, we're going to put this tower over here. How about right there? That looks about good. Uh, then we're going to have these guys put up some ladders. Um, they can attack right there. And you guys will ladder it up right there. All right, excellent. Uh, these guys will shoot at them. And let's just, we're going to have them. I don't know how effective the them shooting is. Uh, it seems like they usually end up taking more casualties uh, than, than anything else. Then they actually, act, you know, end up helping. Um, we're going to have these guys hit with a ladder right there. Uh, is there any other place we could put a ladder? I think we could put a ladder right there. Uh, so I think we will um, if we have any open troops here. All right, let's just unpause this, see who's running. Okay, so we do have troops right here. They can ladder it up right there. All right, excellent. Um, and you guys are going to hit up the night runners. Uh, and yes, they are trying to fuck up my troops. That's unfortunate. Um, so yeah, we're trying to get this this gatehouse destroyed. We're at 3% damage, or actually 6% damage for the gate uh, right now. Uh, everybody must fight. All right, this guy has taken a little bit of damage here. I wonder if... Uh, he can do anything here that might help. I don't know if any of these can be undone on a wall. Seems no. Cannot target if on a wall. Okay, whatever. Um, can we... I don't think we're close enough to target them. We'd have to get up too close and then take damage. Uh, so we will wait. So yeah, our troops are getting taken, already taking significant casualties. As you can see, we already lost like 200 fucking dudes, man. Uh, which is unfortunate. Um, oh, and the rats have come out. Uh, that is interesting to see. Uh, we're going to attempt to fight these clan rats while they're out. Um, attack them. <laughs> what are they doing? Yeah, I have no idea what's going on there. Get them. All right, so yeah, we're going to attempt to fight them there. Uh, our ladders are on the walls now. Uh, we're going to be fighting some clan rats here. This is our uh, our uh, dread spears. Uh, we also have the dark shards up on the um, tower there. And this might actually open up for us. Yeah, look at that. Um, sure, why not? Let's see if we can get in there and keep the gate open. Um, that'd be pretty cool if we could. And already we're firing into the, uh, clan rat shields over there. It looks like they did destroy this tower. Um, uh, maybe, perhaps. I'm not sure. It looks like it might have got destroyed. Nope, nope, it just opened up. Alright, so we are fighting the slingers down here. Get them. 
All right, trying to get them uh, destroyed. We have these guys coming out as well. Uh, these guys will do significant damage to whoever's up here. Uh, we're on the uh, tower up here from our ladders. Um, and there's more troops, more clan rats down here, interestingly enough. Um, that's confusing. Uh, they are doing some weird shit, man. Um, so, yeah, let's go ahead and... You know what? Let's go ahead and attack these guys. Uh, we are actually going to... Get over there. Attack them with melee. Um, I know that's probably going to result in a ton of casualties, uh, but it's fine. Uh, we'll shoot up at them. I don't know if they can even hit them. Uh, we're going to try to anyway. Get them. All right, we don't actually need to use this tower here. Uh, get in there. Let's go ahead and r drive our cavalry into there. See if we can. Come here. Yeah, it won't let me go in here because they're still saying that the gatehouse hasn't been destroyed yet. Even though it's wide open here, it doesn't make a whole lot of sense, honestly. Uh, but they will not let me go in there. Um, come on, get in there. Charge! Can I get in here? Yeah, I don't know. We're going to try and charge in there and see if we can get in there. Uh, our warriors are fleeing. Damn them. All right, let me just take a look at how the situation is going, kind of uh, swing around here, see how things are working. Uh, Dread Spears here are not doing well. Um, yeah, I mean, they're, well, they're doing okay for when I mean, you look at how many they're fighting here. Uh, but, yeah, there are a ton of units over here. We've already taken significant casualties, unfortunately. Um, it's always hard doing siege battles, especially when you don't have enough uh, equipment. We didn't have, we had to use a lot of ladders. Ladders just, frankly, aren't as good. Um, so, yeah, they're wavering here, so it looks like we might have won over here. This is the Black Guard, of course, so they can win this whole battle by themselves, practically. Probably going to take a lot of casualties. It's going to take us a while to recover from this, guys. These guys are over here. Let's go ahead and have them. Um, why don't you guys go... Hmm. I think we're going to have them fire on uh, some of these units here. Or we could also have them go this way. Go that way, and then fire on any troops that are over there. Or, hmm... Could have them fire on them. That'll work too. Yeah, that'll work. We'll have them shoot at them. Uh, if they can hit them. Looks like they can. Excellent. Fuck them rats up. They don't have any armor, so it's a lot easier to fuck the rats up. Uh, what's going on in the gate, man? Yeah, the gate's just all fucked up, man. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I have no idea what's going on with the gate. Uh, these guys need to get the fuck out of there. Yeah, let's get these guys out of there. They're almost dead. I don't have to rebuild them. Let's get them out of there. Run! Alright, because yeah, they're just about done for. Uh, these troops as well are having some issues. Um, I guess they're going up here. Uh, what's going on with the troops that got on the wall? Uh, where are they at? Let's go and attack here, these clan rats. Uh, you guys are currently, should be fighting the clan rats, right? Um, you guys are fighting them slingers. Uh, all of the troops are over here, it seems. Okay. Uh, can we use this tower? Is there anybody here to use the tower? It doesn't seem like it. Yeah, see, it sucks because we can't really get in here. Let's try and have, seems that these Dark Riders just about died over here. Let's go and have him uh, retreat. No reason for that one guy to die. Unnecessarily. Alright, come on guys, get in there. Kill him. Alright, so we're bringing our general in there. Um, I don't know who they can fire on. Let's have them fire on them since shooting at the gate seems pointless right now. Um, yeah, it just doesn't seem like there's any reason to be doing that. Let's fire on the Night Runners instead. See what's going on over here. Uh, let's go ahead and have one of these guys, since there's two of them up here. Let's go ahead and have the these guys here. Uh, they're gonna come, they're gonna come down here. Fire on them, uh, and then we'll have the other ones. What do we got here? We got two of them. Yeah, we'll have these guys come this way. All right, excellent. Let's go ahead and get the black guard down downstairs. Or you know what? We should probably have them fight on this wall here, kill all these troops. No, no, no. You guys come over here. Charge. Okay, and so our leader is here. Um, should be helping boost their abilities. Um, it seems that we just can't get in there. Even though the gate is wide the fuck open. Yeah, this is irritating. Um, yeah, I don't understand what happened there. Looks like we're going to have to get on the battering ram. Yeah, because they just can't... That doesn't make any fucking sense, man. Alright, well he's going to go in there himself. He's going to use the tower. That's fine. I'm okay with him getting in that tower. Um, and yes, these guys have taken a significant damage, however, they're still fighting, still doing their thing. Uh, we have some troops here that currently aren't doing anything. Let's go and have them, uh, uh, we'll have them go this way here. Uh, can they get in the tower? Whatever, I want you guys up here. Just go up there. Alright, so the Black Guard are now downstairs. Let's go and have them fight the Clan Rat Shields over here, uh, that are currently stopping our troops. Um, from, okay, so the gate is wide open again. 
Or is, uh, excuse me, it's closed again. Um, so, yeah, it's just really confusing what the hell's going on with that fucking gate. If it's open, my troops should be able to go into it, whether they control it or not. It was like that in previous uh, Total War games. I don't know why it's not like that anymore. Uh, so our, our troops did run over here. That's not surprising. They're pretty outnumbered there. Um, attack. Attack the wall. All right, and they did decide to hit my uh, Dark Shard shields over here. That's unfortunate. Uh, we're going to go ahead and get them running. There's practically no reason to, to leave them here. Um, they have taken significant casualties. Uh, I don't know what these guys are doing. Um, they got all up close. Just shoot at the gate, please, uh, before you die or you hurt yourself. All right. Um, the Black Guard, they should be... No, this is not the Black Guard. No, this is the uh, Dread Spears here. Let's go and get them moving down. Go that way, please. Uh, you guys are going to come over this way. Fire at them. I don't know why they didn't move. Um, come on down here, please. All right, excellent. Um, so, yeah, we're currently fighting them, uh, trying to get the control of the gate here. Uh, we have troops up on the top as well. I think they're broken and attempting to run. Uh, we do have this guy, these bleak swords that are coming back up here. Uh, our general is here as well. He can't use that uh, on the wall, unfortunately. Uh, but he can target people who are not on the wall. So, yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Let's, let's go like so. Let's see if they run right into that. Might be able to kill some of them. At least I get to use my magic. Yeah, it'll move around, maybe kill a couple of them. You know, it's not extremely effective. Um, but if it kills, well, I don't know. Killed a few of them. Not complaining there. All right, kill these guys. Get them, please. Do the damn thing. Are we into the goddamn gate yet? Is the gate destroyed? Yeah, I'm not sure what's going on here. It looks like our... Get in there. Charge. We're going to send all these guys in. We're going to send these guys in, too. Everybody's got to go in there. Looks like we do have access now. All right, awesome. Send our cavalry in too. Um, I know that they're you know going to take significant casualties. It's fine. We need everybody in the battle, guys. That's just the way it is right now. Um, oh no, hold up. It looks like we're out of ammunition here. You just hold, hold then, and let these guys fire on them. All right. So what are you guys doing? The dread spears? Nothing. Let's go ahead and charge in here. Uh, try and get control of the center. Um, there are a lot more troops over here. I don't know what they're doing. Uh, they're gonna let me take control of the center though. I'm absolutely fine with that um, And we're still just engaged in just massive battle over here Come on guys get in here um, You know what we're probably gonna have you Melee, I don't know. I uh, will let them uh, fling some Some uh, spears at him first at javelins uh, Let's go ahead and have them attack Get in there or right, we'll just have them run in now. It looks like they are just about done here. All right, excellent. So we do get everyone, almost everybody on the the wall running. Let's have these guys charge in. We're gonna send our, our general in as well. Um, although I'm tempted, no, no, no. Let's get the general moving down. Let's get him going down here. All right, excellent. So everybody should be uh, engaged. Uh, so he's currently running. Let's just go ahead and have him. Uh, yeah, if he wants to run, that's fine with me. Keep on fire on them, please. Let's go ahead and get these guys going in here. All right, excellent. Uh, we can have him fight him if they, he, he doesn't want to leave. Because we're trying to seize control of their center. Um, still over here fighting. Uh, let's see if we can get these guys destroyed uh, before they can get back to the center. Um, the cavalry here, let's go ahead and have them um, move in here. You guys going this way as well. Uh, and what is our general currently doing? He's not doing anything. Get down there. Come on. Killing me, man. Killing me. Uh, can't, I don't think these guys can fire over walls. Uh, it doesn't seem that way anyways. So we'll just have to leave them there, I guess. That's fine. Uh, we don't need them any further. Uh, so all their troops are currently running right now. Um, let's go and attack them. They're already wavering, so should be able to get them destroyed re relatively quickly. Um, they do have their other troops coming over here now. Let's go ahead and charge. Charge! Let's go ahead and throw some spears at them as well. Um, a lot more troops coming over here. And is he running yet? He is broken and running. Uh, let's go and have... Uh, these guys can fight too, I guess. Hop in that fight. Uh, so Calvary is currently chasing down these uh, Skaven slaves here. Uh, we're also uh, throwing some javelins at them. Let's instead get them going this way. All right, excellent. Uh, and then we're going to have our Black Guard come over here. Charge them, please. Uh, and the cavalry is currently fighting this guy here. Uh, hopefully he'll be able, to, be able to do it. I don't know if they can. Um, they can beat that guy by themselves. Yeah, perhaps. It looks like he is running. All right, where is our general? Why is everybody stuck up on this fucking... I've, I've told these guys to get down multiple times, and they are having some issues uh, coming down here. Come on, guys. You guys can do it. Just get down, please. 
Uh, we need to get our general down as well. So we just got a bunch of people stuck on the fucking wall while the battle's going on over here. This is where the fight is. Uh, so yeah, we need to get our guys over here now. Shoot at them, please. All right, so trying to hold these these uh, these rats back over here. Um, where is the cavalry? Uh, they are currently chasing down some troops here. Uh, you guys are gonna, uh, you can charge them there. Sure, why not? Um, and then the cavalry here, we're gonna have them, we're gonna have them wrap around over here if I can. Go this way. All right, we're gonna try and get behind those those troops there. Um, you guys are gonna be getting into the battle. Charge, men! All right, and then we're gonna have these guys come up over here. Uh, and then the Black Guard needs to get there as well. Well, they're currently about to battle these Clan Rat Shields. Um, and then our General, where is our General? He is here, awesome. Let's go ahead and get him into the battle. Uh, and then we're gonna use our Vortex on some troops here. Uh, we're gonna use it like so. Try and fuck up some troops right there. Uh, it should be close enough soon. There we go, it looks like it did go the reverse way, not the way we wanted it to go. It's gonna fuck our own troops up, I think. I don't know if that actually does damage to our troops. Um, they certainly are running like they, they're scared. Um, so, yeah, a lot of damage taken here from our troops. It's okay. Get in there. Fight. Fight, men. We are ticking it down now. About fucking time. Hit them up. Um, let's go ahead and bring... We, t we took a ton of casualties in this battle. However, you know what? If we get the fucking city, then it's worth it. Uh, get in the battle, guys. Get into the battle. Your warriors are rallying. All right, um, get in the fight. Fight somebody. Fight somebody, please. Um, there's a little bit of room here. We could do a wind, wind attack. Maybe. There we go. Hit a few of them up. Um, it looks like the Warlord's the one right now currently holding this back a bit more. Um, and victory has been achieved. Wow. All right. So that was a rough, rough battle, guys. Uh, definitely a Pyrrhic victory. Um, it can always be kind of difficult taking walls. Uh, we didn't have enough equipment either. Uh, but all of them are going to die here. So that is a total of 1,700 troops that they're going to lose in total. Uh, we lost 761, though. So, yeah, significant casualties. I don't know. Uh, obviously, those Dyke Riders are, are not going to make it. They're probably going to be dead. Uh, I don't know if any of these other troops are, are going to be dead as well. Um, but, yeah, definitely some big casualties. But we have the city, finally. All right, excellent. Um, so, yeah, destroyed all their troops, with the exception of those reinforcements. Those reinforcements were able to uh, leave here. Um, so that sucks. A little bit. And we got ourselves a talisman. Nice. Um, should have leveled up. Excellent. We got ourselves a rank there. Um, ton of money. Uh, and we are just going to occupy this. We've got enough issues uh, when it comes to uh, public order right now. So let's just occupy any further problems. And we'll have the Altar of Ultimate Darkness in our hands, which is excellent to see here. Uh, we did kill Caracas. Okay, got it. We got the Talisman as well, uh, which is the Dragon Bane Gem. It's a fire resistance of 30%. Eh, I don't know how useful that is. Uh, we don't really, we haven't really seen too much fire attacks on us recently. Um, so I'm interested to see what is this quest issued? Win the falling battle with Malchus army. Um, circle of iron over here. So following a display of Malchus temper, the death hags are suddenly more forthcoming. Malchus must indeed travel northward to the altar of ultimate darkness, a shrine of pure chaos. The power residing within the altar must be observed by the circle of iron before it can ironically be used against the chaos god. Should Malchus step into the vortex and take dominion? All right, um, so we have a little mission here that we're gonna have to do, um, and it's against the enemies of chaos. So we have the Forsaken and Chaos Knights. Okay, um, all right, we're not gonna be able to fight them just yet, uh, but yeah, that is interesting. That will give us that circlet of iron thing that apparently we need really bad. Uh, we are going to, I almost wanna merge these two here. Um, although, yeah, I kinda wanna merge them here uh, just so that we can get new the new better ones. When do we get that? Let me just take a look here uh, when we should have the... Okay, so in... Well, that's Den of Outlaws. It'll be tur two turns be before we get the, uh, the Longhouse, unfortunately. All right. Um, maybe we want to merge these two. Um, and that's probably going to be... Well, we can merge these two as well. Let's go to merge them. And then we're going to merge uh, two of these as well. We're going to merge these two. Because I want to get them all turned over to the Dark Shards with shields eventually. That's kind of one of my goals here. Uh, these guys are probably all fine. I know the numbers are, are really bad, but there's nothing really that I'm trying to transition them to. Let's go and upgrade ourselves. Uh, we're going to go ahead and get... Ooh, we can get our cold one here. Well, that'd be pretty cool. It does reduce our melee attack uh, and our weapon strength, um, but it does increase our speed, armor, and charge bonus. Hmm. 
I kind of think we're going to get it, guys. Let me just see what else we have available. Missile resistance and magic resistance. Okay. I, I think we're going to get it. Um, I think it would be a good idea to get the cold one. Um, yeah, just it's a fucking dinosaur, man. So, yeah, let's go and grab that. Get ourselves a dinosaur. Uh, Mount Gain cold ones. Got it. Uh, and I believe that's going to be all we're going to be doing uh, before the end of the episode here. Um, yeah, I think we're going to end it here, guys. Um, we won that battle. We have the Altar of Ultimate Darkness. Man, was it difficult to get. Uh, we're going to have to build something here before we end the turn. Um, is there a unique building here? Uh, landmark? Yes, you can build the Altar of Ultimate da Darkness. Okay. Um, so, yeah, we're going to want to get that there in that slot. Um, and then I'm not sure what else we're going to get here. Uh, but yeah, we're going to end the turn here, guys, or end the episode, excuse me. If you enjoyed the video, then please leave a like. Consider subscribing to the channel, and thanks for watching, guys.